Hello, everyone. That's me. Hi. <laughs> um, I'm doing this little vlog as promised because I wanted to do a little tour of the place I'm staying at. I'm in Hartford, Connecticut. It's very historic. I like this old, like, it's pretty hot, though. I'm staying in a house. It's like pretty much like this house. It's huge, but they're like sectioned off. Like I'm on the third floor, so I'm like at the very top. Um, I think they're pretty historic. Like these are like old houses that have been just like refurbished, re like built. It's like a huge like walk-in pan. Like I could walk my entire self in here. Turn the lights on. Yeah, like this is like a really big closet space slash pantry slash whatever you want to make it. Um, I told the guy that owns this place, or not that owns this place, but like that runs this for, that he should think about like stacking that up with food. Oven, I mean the oven's kind of old too, but it's, you know, newer appliances. Cabinets, um, kind of a makeshift table thing here. That's the door to the outside. Let me just open it to show you. See, we're like on the third floor. This is like a little balcony that's attached to like, well, this is like, I guess a part of this floor and then lots of windy stairs downstairs. I don't get like a weird presence here, like of like haunted, whatever. <laughs> I mean, maybe because I'm past that stage in my life where I get paranoid about like old places. Um, so yeah, this is like the kitchen. It's pretty sizable. I mean, it's pretty big. Then they have this like kitchen this is like not the this is the kitchen but this is where like the sink is it's like these one of these huge like industrial type sinks i'm trying to turn the light on so i got this like led thing and you know for like a bunch of boys he's just like this is like a storage space it's like stuff in here um, i thought it was a room i guess in a way this could be like someone's like tiny ass if they wanted to say a small ass room this is not a functional washer, from what I can recall. I don't think it works. Um, or maybe it does. I don't know. But they don't have a dryer. And then they have a furnace um, system going on. Like, where when I got here, it was so cold. It was super cold. But, you know, they have this little system here. I'm not very good at describing, like, you know. I put it at 72 because it was, like, really hot. But it was really cold initially. All right, so that's, this is a little hallway. That's the room to the guy who, like, the main dude who's been here for, like, eight years, apparently. And this is the bathroom. It's a pretty decent size. Not very luxurious, but it works. I got different, like, lights. Yeah. Very makeshift. He has the biggest room, according to what he tells me. This is where we're staying. He still has yet to open up gifts. Um, this is where we're staying. Well where he's staying, the bed, that's the window. It's very cozy in here, I love it. It's cute, I like the hardwood floors. And a little mirror, hello. And I don't know what kind of furniture piece this is, but it's holding items. We're going to furnish this, furnish this accordingly. That's my job, needed that feminine touch. Um, fire extinguisher, and that's it refrigerator they got some food in here he like went to town and like cleaned it last night i offered to help he's like no no i guess he wanted me to just kind of get up and do it but i'm not fully moved in yet so yeah it's not gonna happen until i fully move in i have been keeping it clean here like i have i'm gonna sweep because there's some dust that accumulated but that's all i got for now um i'll come back and do some more little tours of like the neighborhood where i'm staying it's a pretty quiet neighborhood um, not too far from New York, so I feel there's some New Yorker natives that come here. I'll talk to you later. Bye.